What's up? My name is Technobo here for Troubleshoot and welcome back to another quick video. In this video, I'll show you how to set Steam so that it doesn't open up with the friends list and or the chat window showing up when you boot up your computer or you start up the program. If you restart your computer, you'll likely see this window appear, the Steam main window. However, something you may also see is the friends list UI as such. And of course, if you're not someone who likes this, then it's pretty difficult to figure out how to turn it off and it's not all that explanatory. On top of this, if you have a chat window open with a friend when you shut down your computer, when you start it up, that chat window may be open once again and you'll have to move them out of the way or close them. I often have the chat window appear even though I've closed chats, I've read all the messages that I've been sent, but it'll still just appear on my computer when I start it up. Of course, that may be annoying to some people and that's exactly what I'll show you how to turn off in this video. When you start up Steam, you'll have nothing but this window over here. Of course, if you click view chat and friends, then you'll be able to see that once again. But without further ado, how do we do it? Well, it's actually really simple. The simplest way to do it is to add something to the shortcut that starts up Steam. I'll hit start, locate the Steam shortcut, right click, more, and open file location. I'll right click the shortcut to Steam, and then properties to bring up the properties window. And here, we'll be adding some commands. Now, you have to go ahead and edit every shortcut that you'd like this to happen with, including shortcuts on your desktop, start menu, and most importantly, when your computer starts up, but we'll get there later. The command in question here is hyphen no friends UI and space hyphen no chat UI. As such, you'll find both of these in the description down below. So no friends UI and no chat UI both with hyphens before them or minuses and spaces between them and anything else in this over here. So I've placed them right after the end code for the Steam location over here as such. Nice and simple. If I hit apply, possibly continue and OK, the shortcut will now be edited. And if I were to start up Steam from this over here, it should no longer have those windows appearing. So I'll go ahead and quit out of Steam and start it up using this modified shortcut. And when it's done, you may only have an advert window as such you won't actually have your friends list open or a chat window open, which is exactly what we were hoping for. Awesome. So it worked. Now you'll need to go ahead and do this for every other shortcut that you can think of on your computer, more than likely just the start menu, which we've already handled, and the shortcut on your desktop. But in order to change how it happens when you start up your computer, that's a little bit more in depth. Pulling across the task manager over here, heading across to the startup section, you'll see Steam is listed here. If yours is listed here and enabled, then it's really simple to edit. Unless, of course, you've added it here manually, not the way that Steam adds it automatically. How do we edit how it works when your computer starts up if you set it to start up within Steam? Well, it's relatively simple. Press start, type in R-E-G-E-D-I-T, reg edit, and open up the registry editor. Click yes when prompted for admin, and you'll land up in something that looks like this. In the description down below, you'll find some text starting with H key. Go ahead and copy that entire line, Head into Registry Editor and select everything at the top over here. Hit Ctrl and V to paste it in, or right click paste, and you'll see this. H key current user software Microsoft Windows current version run. Hit enter and it'll be taken into a folder on the left with all of the files on the right. That's the simplest way to explain it. In order to edit how Steam starts up with our computer, edit the Steam entry over here. So either double click or right click and modify. Then you'll see all of the options that we have for Steam. Yours will more than likely only have silent, which starts it up in your task tray instead of pulling up the entire Steam window, as far as I understand. In here, you'll want to head to the very end, hit space, and once again enter hyphen no chat UI and space hyphen no friends UI as such. After doing so, clicking OK, the next time you restart your computer or log in, Steam will start up without a chat window or the friends UI showing. It'll be just the normal Steam application. And of course, if you'd like to turn it off starting in your task tray or anywhere else, whatever that silent command does, you can remove it and have Steam open up in its full normal state when you boot up your computer on your screen. But anyways, that's about it for this quick video. Thank you all for watching. My name's been Techno Behavior Troubleshoot. Hopefully you found this video useful and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.